Ahoy there, mateys! Today, we at FreeRangeClub.com have come up with a healthier version of tuna salad. Why do you ask? Because so much mercury and other poisons have been dumped into our oceans and other waterways and over the, ha over the last half century that now, unfortunately, all marine life contains some of them. Although, how much of it depends upon their sizes. The smallest species, floating on the lowest part of the food chain, have the least amount of mercury and are the safest to consume, while the big fishes that feast on them accumulate the most mercury in their tissues. Since tuna is a big fish which stores whopping amounts of mercury throughout even its most delicious sushi-grade flesh, we have come up with not one, but two alternative choices for a fish salad that is much richer and better tasting but with a similar mouthfeel as the original tuna based fish dish that inspired it and of course much lower in mercury and other gross toxins. The super healthy wild caught sardine canned in extra virgin olive oil of course and containing its skin and bones which is where most of the nutrients come from barely has any traces of pollutants and the equally healthy water stored wild caught salmon with low levels of bad agents to render it safe for a healthy diet. The basic recipe is already up on our website, freerangeclub.com, under the recipes tab, of course. But since our recipe guru, Dina, prefers to improvise, she calls it jazz cooking, you are free to change the suggested ingredients that I'll be using today. today. So what you're going to do is you're going to add your three cans of wild-caught Alaskan salmon along with your two tins of sardines into a bowl with a few hard-boiled eggs along with mayonnaise that's made with extra virgin olive oil, organic Dijon mustard, and fresh squeezed lemon juice. You're going to add that into a bowl into a large mixing bowl like so and just mix it make sure it's as homogenous as you can make it. And once that is done, you're going to add your organic wild capers. And a quick side note, you're going to add all of the oil that was in the sardine cans because it is made with extra virgin olive oil and that just enhances the flavor of the salad. And then you're going to add all of your spices. Again, if you need to know the ingredients, they're located on our website herbs and spices go in here and mm, Dina you did well this smells so good like so and you can always accommodate to the people that will be eating this if they like more spice less spice you can add any other vegetables that you prefer and you're just going to mix this really well all of the capers and this smells delicious and again like I've spoken before in our previous videos the herbs and spices add a lot of flavor without adding any fat any bad stuff there we go mixing it for a while in the large bowl I just added it to a smaller bowl to serve and I decorated it with some organic cherry heirloom tomatoes and this is how we always decorate our foods when giving them when serving them to friends and family and it just looks beautiful this was so easy to make takes no time to prepare and I can't wait to enjoy this